welcome back to my channel uh, today I want to do another review it's going to be a review of another product that is supposed to work as a primer in case you haven't heard about this <sighs> so this is a massage cream for stretch marks and um, it's currently being advised by beauty gurus um, to try it out and so as usual I'm gonna try it out for you and let you know if you can really rely on this as a primer so some of the um, ingredients in this product that are probably making it attractive and worth trying as a primer are vitamin E collagen elastin and shea butter so um, apart from this I'm also going to use my usual primer I really love this it's um, it's prime and fine uh, pore refining anti shine base so yeah my primer says that it is mattifying long lasting and oil free it's from Catrice and it's uh, it can be found in in any drugstore so um, let's just go ahead and try this so what I'm gonna do is I today I won't have two screens today I'll apply half of my face with one product and half with another product so that we can see the difference so I'll just do the basics on cam and the rest of the stuff I'll do off camera and then I'll come back with everything done so that we can see if there is any visible difference I already applied a moisturizer on my face this is the half face that's gonna have the cocoa butter um, massage cream for stretch marks so the tube is actually big, so if this is going to work, I think it's going to be so perfect. So I don't really know what amount I need, but I think, I think this is too much. So... the rest of the makeup off camera and come to you once everything is done so and here I am with the finished look so from the first impression I don't know I feel I feel like I'm getting some brushes already or maybe I'm just paranoid but yeah looks flawless for now so I'll just go outside, walk around, um, get some grocery and by the time I'm back I'll make sure it takes about 9 hours again so that I can see if there is any difference, if I'm oilier on which side or not on which side. Yeah, so um, I'll get back to you later and uh, we'll check this out. Hi guys, so um, it's exactly nine hours since I applied this. <laughs> Once again, this is the side where I tried um, the stretch mark cream, the Palma stretch mark cream. And this is the side where I tried my usual 
a primer from Catrice. Uh, tell me, can you notice any difference? Yeah, let me just get closer. You see, I can't really. Both sides are oily, I would say. My nose area, the part where I usually get the most oily, is oilier than ever. <laughs> So yeah, I don't know, I don't know how it's working for other people but for me it's definitely not my thing and I also noticed some rashes on this side so I guess my face is still reacting to this. Maybe if I would use it more often it would get better but at the moment it's something that my face has reacted to. Yeah, so that's the side with a stretch mark cream and that's the side with a normal primer. Yeah, so definitely not uh, worth the money, you know. Still, I would say once again the same thing I said with the Via Men's Aftershave Balm. If you already have a primer, don't waste your money on this. If you already have a primer that's working well for you, then just keep it and leave this for people whom it's working for. It's probably for people with dry skin, probably. Yeah, that was the test. I hope you liked this clip. If it was helpful, don't forget to leave me a thumbs up. And if you aren't subscribed yet to my channel, make sure you do that. I hope to catch you all in the next video. Stay blessed and have a blessed week. Bye-bye. Put, um, yeah, and for that, I want really that there. So. so, that's my talent. How easy did you find it? I think it's super easy and super quick. I really do this when I'm um, in a hurry, 